I'm up to Nessa. How are you? What's good? Today we are back. We are watching My Strange Addiction, Still Addicted. This is the urine drinking episode. So the reason why I decided to put on yellow <laughs> to match the aesthetic, I guess. First time seeing it. Y'all want me to still keep going with this series, so I had to bring it back. Luckily, I ate before I watched this one also, but hopefully I don't throw it up by the end of this episode. But anyway, shout out to everybody that's currently watching the premiere. How you doing? How you looking? How you smelling? I hope you're doing, looking, and smelling amazing. Your boy is doing and looking wonderful and we are currently smelling like hold on because i forgot what this is called uh pasha de cartier parfum okay look at that look at that it's also matching the aesthetic the yellow the yellow yes smells really good it's very strong so you don't got to really spray too much of it but that's what your boy's currently smelling like not sponsored if you haven't been told this you matter and i love you i really do thank you for being here also make sure you guys are drinking your water and staying hydrated it is very very important important anyways enough of the talker for this intro we're gonna do plenty of talker for this video so if that's not your thing go ahead get up out of here now you've been warned but let's get straight into my strange addiction still addicted urine drinkers my name is nick cheers bro did they just cheers on a oh oh and we are addicted to drinking our urine oh they are gross you He's never drunk a water. Half gallon of fresh urine. <gasps> smells like buttery popcorn. Buttery popcorn? I ain't never smelled no pee that smelled like popcorn. Never. It almost feels like a drug. Oh, they are some freaks. I gotta wash down the burger with something. Why are you doing this? Oh, that I, you're not coming to my dinner table with pee. Oh, you would have to fight me. It's a decade later. I'm still sleeping with my blow <sighs> dryer. You okay, is this one real? Is this fake? Like. No way. She sleeps with her air dryer? Hair dryer? That's my life. Isn't that like a fire hazard sleeping with the air dryer on the whole time? Or am I tripping? My name is Nick. My name is Aubrey. And we are the pee drinkers. Yeah. Hey, I bet you they got an OnlyFans, huh? I bet they do. I sleep on the ground. I surf, jump off high things into water. <laughs> okay, so they talk about pee shop. Is he peeing in that damn jar right now? And about the... Oh! 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 Oh, this is nasty, nasty. Yo, you know what, Nick? Bravo to you. You found you another little freak elite like yourself. Tuna Tiff and Tim? He ain't got no chance of hell. Nick and Aubrey both drink 200 gallons of urine each year. How are they hydrated? Like, is there nutrients in pee I didn't know about? Oh my goodness, Elma. And his pee is golden yellow. On an average day, I probably drink between a half gallon and a gallon. Bro, I'm about to throw up. I'm not even lying to y'all. I'm literally sick. There's no way I can keep watching this TV show back to back to back. I can't do it. So this would be a great time for us to take a break. And you know, one of my favorite things to do while taking a break is playing a really fun mobile game. For those of you who have been watching the channel for a while, you guys know that I love me a good little mobile game. I spend a lot of time playing them. So it's like, I might as well get rewarded for doing it. That's what makes today's sponsor, Misplay, so cool. They are the leading loyalty app that actually does reward you with gift cards for simply downloading and playing games through the Misplay app. If you play mobile games every day like myself, this would be a perfect way to cover that coffee with a gift card even though i think that some of y'all should still be drinking water but i digest here's another cool fact about misplay that over a hundred million dollars in gift cards have been redeemed Yes, you heard the number correctly. Plus, Misplay has helped me discover so many new games that I would have never heard of. Misplay has a huge catalog that expands to many genres like puzzles, word, adventure, strategy, and so much more. My favorite game that I downloaded is Marble Master. This game is so brainless, but it is very, very fun. And it makes it even better knowing that I'm racking up points through Misplay. So basically how it works is the more you play, the more points you earn. That can be redeemed for gift cards from all of your favorite brands like Amazon, Visa, Sephora. So if you would like to be rewarded for discovering new games, use my link misplay.com slash Billy or click the link that's in the description and pin comment to download Misplay for free. You will get 200 points just for signing up today. Also be sure to use my code Billy50 inside the app to get an additional 50 points, which does help you redeem your very first gift card. Thank you so much for Misplay for sponsoring today's video. Now let's get back into my strange addiction really do feel more nourished drinking your urine than you do drinking water. Is there any facts to what he just said? He said he feels more nourished. Okay, do y'all drink y'all pee? Have y'all been peed on? There's a number that you can call just in case. Unless it was consensual, then, you know, so be it. This tastes faintly like my smoothie tastes. 
No, I know that it doesn't taste like no smoothie. Uh, you're, come on, man, you're selling a dream. We're seeing liquids on Earth, and it's 100% free, and it's always on tap. I hate when they do that. They, mm. See, watching this show makes me not even want to drink water. How ironic is that? Like, I don't even want to drink water. I feel radiant, vibrant, vital. Can we find out when's the last time they went to the doctor? Like, just to find out if this is actually good for them? I use it in my hair. I use it as eardrops sometimes. I use it as eye drops sometimes. Oh. oh, this is insanity. Right now, we're about to take a pee shower. See, a pee shower, if you gonna take an actual shower after it, to me, doesn't sound that bad, right? I, I'm not gonna lie to you. Don't sound that bad if you gonna take a real shower with soap and water, not pee. It's a little, it's different. What's wrong with him? Yeah, I don't know. I don't yeah, the dad is definitely embarrassed. Nick first tried urine on vacation during a medical emergency and he never went back. I was in Aruba, my hands clenched up really hard. I'm not gonna lie, he looked like a malnourished lion. When he was in that little position, he looked very sick. And as soon as I took like one sip and touched it to my tongue. I mean, I'm not gonna lie, they both look very good to be drinking pee. So I, I can't even lie, <laughs> they look good. It's crazy. I slid into Nick's DMs. Oh, she slid in your DMs. And invited him to come stay with me and uh, just hit it off. Nah, he hit that thing off. <laughs> off the bone, that's what he did. He blew that back out, girl. <laughs> she was like, what, you drink pee? I drink pee too. Mm -hmm. Want some green juice? It's fire. <laughs> she said it's fire. Yeah. Good, what was it, celery, apple? And cilantro and lemon. And yeah. Pee. So is he gonna say that there's more nutrients when she's on her cycle? Like, are you still drinking the pee during that time too? So not only do we drink our urine, we also snort it. Huh, wait, y'all do what? And why is she reaching into her kunana like she got a, <laughs> she was in her pants, <laughs> like she had a hangle dangle. And then I wasn't expecting her to pull out a damn jar from her kanuchi. I wasn't expecting that, I swear. Sniff and then swallow and then sniff, sniff and then swallow and repeat. You're teaching her to drink through her nose? That doesn't even sound comfortable. Like, have you ever like had water go down the wrong pipe or sniffed water before? Like, that's painful. Oh, oh, he, oh, oh. Oh, 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 oh my God. Oh gosh, I can't keep looking at this shit. I can't, I cannot. And 10 years ago, I was addicted to sleeping with my blow dryer. Oh, I forgot what she was on the episode for. I was like, who is this? One night, turn on this blow dryer. The sound of it, the warmth of it. How long are you able to leave a hair dryer going? Like she said, like while she sleeps, that's at least like six to eight hours, right? Yo, the dog is like, for real, lady, come on, man. We can't sleep with this noise. It sound like the airport in here. Started working from home about eight years ago. I wonder how often she has to replace her hair dryers. It's just right there and you can just take a quick little break, recharge. What do you mean recharge? Huh, is she putting the, the hair dryer on her kunana? Is she letting that get hot too? Um, anyways, over the past 10 years, Lori has cycled through over 40 blow dryers. Her addiction has cost her over 15,000 in energy bills. That's crazy. $15,000 in energy just for one hair dryer? Roxy is one of my really good friends. It's always interesting to me how these shows are always set up the same where they have friends that don't know their addiction. But it's like at some point it would have had to come up during conversation or you've been on the phone with them and you heard like that loud blowing noise like and you didn't like, hey girl, what's that noise? Like you would think that the conversation would have at least been had at least once or twice throughout their friendship. Hi, what you doing? You know, Andrea's 15 years old. Where are the dads at? We always keep seeing the mom, but like, where's her dad at? Guess I'd take this too. Life of a mom with a son who drinks just urine. Wait a minute, your son lives with you though? What? Tell him not to leave him around. But if he's gonna live here, he's gotta, gotta live by our rules. I wouldn't be pouring that out. I would tell him to bring his grown ass in here and pour his pee jars out. This man has pee jars all over the house. Like it's Easter eggs. She just doesn't like it for her own personal preference. She doesn't have to look into it deeper. That's your thing, not hers. And you're in her house. By the way, your parents are rich as hell. Can I be a part of their family? Hey mama, I don't drink pee. Can you put me in the will? Cucumber salad. Did you clean it? Yeah, I did. With what? With myself. Oh, that is so gross. This man said he cleaned it with himself. Before the injections, I was a size four and now I'm in a size 10. 
<coughs> oh dang, she is passionate about that for real. Carmelo has had over 50 ounces of injections pumped into her behind. That's nearly two liters of liquid in her butt. I am proud to say I'm healthy, I'm good, I'm blessed. Okay, well at least they gave us one W. You know, I thought that they were gonna keep showing us people that were still addicted, so. All right, we finally got one person that gave it up. My family and I eat dinner together fairly often, at least. I wouldn't have him cooking nothing in my house though, cause he don't wash his hands and I don't like that. Bro, no way did you just pee right in front of the stove and then he's pouring it on a cucumber. Golly. They don't have to eat any of the cucumbers, but this will open. He said it's going to open the conversation. That's not how that works, bro. You're forcing it on them. At least tell them before they eat it. My dad is much more understanding. Wait, your dad is understanding? Oh, okay, never mind. I thought that his daddy would be able to talk sense, but it sounds like your daddy don't got sense either. It's not gonna hurt you live there. I don't really wanna eat if there's pee on the table. Exactly, nobody wants to. So you've cleaned the cucumber with that. Yeah. yeah. Oh, his daddy is nasty. I'm gonna get myself a drink. Anyone want one? How about you stop smacking while you go do that? Cause why are you smacking that hard? Why would you ever do that right there? That's so disrespectful. It's very disrespectful. Like, why is he doing that? Your wine could never match this. Oh my gosh, man. Why are you trying to ruin dinner so badly? What are, the, what are the benefits here? There are lots of benefits. It definitely helps with my digestion. Yeah, no, we need to see like some actual facts behind what you're saying. Cause what you're saying sound good. Cause you say it confidently, but I need to hear a professional say that this is a fact. You're cleaning the glasses though. <laughs> all right, nah, he's doing all the damn dishes since he want to play around. Honestly, I wouldn't want to watch me getting stabbed repeatedly over and over and over again. Seeing my four-year-old son like that, he could have lost me any day. Yeah, but you wasn't thinking about that at the time because you just wanted to do what you wanted to do. I definitely grown as a woman, a better woman, a better mom. Hey man, the way that these kids be growing up is crazy because I didn't watch like the original episodes of this, but literally them growing up at the blink of the next scene is crazy to me right now. She noted that the motivation for her quitting was her child. Kids can be like the greatest motivation ever, honestly, and they can bring the greatest change that'll ever come to your life. I was selfish and I don't want that. Let's clap it up for Carmelo. Let's clap it up. Let's clap it up. She's taking accountability, ownership. I love that. Love to see. And this is what this is why she grew. This is why she grew. I'm happy for her for real. And yesterday I went and got blood. <laughs> Yo, why is he walking like Johnny Bravo? <laughs> hey there, little birdie. Hold on, what? Hey there, pretty lady. I'm a little excited because I know the results are gonna be good. He's like better than the results that you're about to tell me. I know that. And are you sterilizing the urine? No. That man is drinking it raw, like straight up. This is like, he's doing it all the time. It's the only thing he's drinking, really. Yeah, let's see what his blood work say, because I'm very curious. But the thing that really kind of caught my eye was your creatinine. Uh, the creatinine's at 1.2. Yeah, but can you explain to me what that is, though? Because I don't know what a cranny is. Crentinine is a toxic byproduct, unhealthy at high levels. Normally, it's flushed out through our urine. So how much water are you drinking? He ain't drinking no water at all. Drink water at all? At all. The kidneys need pure hydration as in water. Y'all hear that? That's why you need to drink water. Save your kidneys. Some of y'all don't care. Enough. Go drink water right now. I ain't said it this whole video. Drink water. I can't do it because I've been watching them drink pee this whole time and I just can't. But I will once this video is over. <laughs> if you keep going this way, then at some point the kidneys are going to give out. Yo, he's looking like, I don't know what to tell you, doc, but um, him ain't stopping drinking pee. Him not going to do that. Help me. Help me. Help me. If we continue this way, then things could get really bad for you. He like, Doc, things don't get bad for you if you don't stop telling me I need to stop drinking my pee, okay? You're a liar, I know what I'm talking about. I'm the expert here. I'm good, how are you? Making a fruit salad. Fruit salad, yummy, yummy. Shout out to the Wiggles, y'all had a boppery. That joker is always stuck in my head. Every time I hear a fruit salad. How do you feel about me using the blow dryer? Oh. Like, what do you think about? <laughs> you can tell that she wants to say a, a lot. She's not gonna say what she really wants to say to her mom. She's trying to protect her feelings. That long silence said a lot. Do you like ever plan on stopping or like when do you think? She's like, I ain't never thought about stopping. Like that was never an option. I do plan on stopping. Yeah, I don't have a date set. That means no, she doesn't plan on stopping. She thinks my kidneys are gonna fail in the long term. Dang, you can tell that he is pissed off by what she's saying. Cause his energy is like, she thinks that I'm gonna die soon because I keep drinking my pee and I'm hard hit. 
benefited. There has been no study showing actual benefit, real, real scientific benefit. And he's like, I'll sign up for it. Let him be the test study. He's already been doing it. If you had a UTI and you snorted it, that could, that actually can go up to your brain and cause. If he had one or his girl had one. If there's bacteria in the urine, which most of the time there's at least a little bit. He's like, well, if I was gonna die, it would have been happened a long time ago, doc. So I'm living proof that I'm a god. Part of you worry about this or want to stop doing Does any part of him look like he worries? That man doesn't think at all anything. He's like, I'm good. I know what I'm doing. I really don't think that I'm dehydrated. I consume a lot of hydrating liquids. Mm-hmm. Yeah. He, he recites this speech over and over and over again. You could tell. Okay. So it was very good to meet you. Good luck with everything. Thank you. She's like, well, if I can't help you, then, you know, do your thing. Yeah, it was pretty much exactly what I expected it to be. Okay, he definitely lying for sure. Like, why you, you ain't telling the whole truth, bro. If you do feel right doing it, then give it a try. There's really no downsides to having an open mind. There's no downside? What about, what, what, what about your kidneys? Like, so are we just gonna ignore that? He's like, oh, but it still provides some proper nutrients for my kidney. The doctors for me, it actually makes me feel a lot better. Time to drink some pee. Oh. That man went right back to the back door <laughs> and drunk his pee. <laughs> okay. Okay, so that was the urine drinking episode also with the butt injection and the sleeping with the air dryer blower, whatever it's called, hair dryer. Final thoughts on the episode. The drinking pee thing, woof. Shout out to him for finding somebody else that will love him through anything, bro. That is so rare. I'm jealous because you found somebody that's willing to put up with you drinking pee and she's down to drink pee with you, you know? Um, as far as me drinking pee, it's not my thing, you know? Uh, I might, <laughs> you know, I might pee on you. Just kidding. The butt injection girl, shout out to her for, you know, realizing that she wants better and she wants to be around for her son because it could be very dangerous and she might not live long enough to watch her son grow up. So shout out to her for making those proper changes in her life. And then the woman that sleeps with the hair dryer, like I really do think there has to be like some type of attachment issue or something like there. She definitely finds comfort with that hair dryer and she should probably really seek therapy to figure out what that is exactly. But once again, for those who are suffering from any addiction, make sure that you seek help. I should have said that at the beginning of the video, but if you stuck around long enough to hear me say it, shout out to you, but definitely seek help. Addiction is a very real thing. This TV show is for entertainment. I put this on my page for entertainment purposes, but never confuse it that it is a real thing, okay? Anyways, if you guys enjoyed this TV commentary reaction, give this video a thumbs up, comment down below what movie or TV show you wanna see me do next with the hashtag Bingers, B-I-N-G-E-R-S, and I'll get to it whenever I get to it. If y'all really want me to keep going with this TV show, then we'll keep going, but y'all gotta make sure that these videos are at least getting to 50K and 6,000 to 8,000 likes, some, something like that, you know? But these videos have to at least get to 50K and we'll just keep doing episodes as they come. But I do appreciate y'all love and support. Thank you so much for being here. It means a lot. Love each and every single one of y'all. Spread the share right now with some hearts before we go because I need to feel the love and the positivity. I'm gonna go drink a gallon of water to make sure that I'm hydrated and I'm probably gonna go take a nap. But that'll do it for this video. Until my next one, I'll see y'all then. Billy Benjes out.